we only manage the portfolio for those clients who have purchased with us so although we get requests to uh, sell secondary from landlords and buyers on a daily basis uh, we don't really take it on unless they are listing exclusively with us uh, but primarily we stick to managing portfolio for those people who have put their trust in us from day one this allows us to be able to put in all our focus and energy on investors who we work with closely because again we are an end to end management service we are a one stop shop we and that's how we are different as compared to other agencies correct so that's what we try to do now typically why we don't have much trading is because um mostly the investors that we work with and mostly how we like to work also is we like to play a long game so when we sell we don't even though you know different developers will tell you that you can sell after 20% 20% payment or 40% payment or 30% payment or 50% payment so on and so forth what we have seen is that our clients make the maximum money when they hold on to the property until the time of handover at least because once the property comes up then you have a wider audience when you're looking at an exit strategy because again when you're saying off plan secondary when you're looking at off plan secondary you're still selling to investors right so in that situation one investor is buying from the other investor uh and that that pool is very small because that second investor then has to have a trading mindset whereas uh given the way we work we like to educate our clients so Uh, and we tell them what is the best way to make money and they trust us with their money and we invest it as we would our own money so what we choose to do in that situation is we choose to hold on to their properties until at least the time of handover because then that widens our target audience for resale we advise them don't sell right now and mind you we also advise them don't buy right now so the object in different situations so it's not only about just buying because a client came and sat in front of me or just selling because a motivated seller came and sat in front of me so to give you an example one of our regular buyers uh, i'm very very fond of them young couple um uh, in their early 40s uh, they have purchased they have currently uh, purchased about four or five units with us but we met them back in 2018 i want to say 2018 2019 uh and their first purchase with us was when they came they wanted to buy a one bedroom apartment um and at that time imar had launched a wonderful building uh in downtown with gorgeous views of burj khalifa so we asked them to consider burj royal so we asked them to consider a two bedroom apartment in that building because the two bedroom series that we thought was the most value for money was the two bedroom that had views of burj khalifa so we bought that uh, for them 